Lilacs in Bloom is the newest title of a collection from Hot Off the Press. And as always, uh, there are beautiful papers and there are ideas on the back of the packaging. I'll show you those in just a minute. You are going to get um, 12 sheets of paper and they are double sided. They are printed on 80 pound paper and isn't that gorgeous. And on the back side, you're going to get even more. So you're gonna get two of every single thing I'm showing you. Plus, you're going to get 38 cutouts. So I'll show you those in just a moment. Aren't they gorgeous? Really, really pretty. Some dark dots. We've got lilacs all over the place. You can almost smell them, can't you? And there are the cutouts. Again, you're going to get two sheets. Um, many of them have um, greetings and words of encouragement, but some of them are left plain, and that way, you can add dazzles, you can computer journal, you can stamp, you can layer them on top of each other, whatever you like. And then there is the last one. So all of those are in our Lilacs in Bloom. I promised you uh, projects. Well, here is our scrapbook page using that first sheet and um, playing with some of uh, our dazzles. This is the 117 beautiful uh, butterfly dazzles, adding some flowers from 49 and Market, just absolutely beautiful. I love the happy up there in the dazzles. Then there's also this slimline card, and that's a fun addition. Uh, again, you can use um, the cutouts as well as the papers. Now you're seeing some cardstock there, and as you may have guessed, we do have coordinating cardstock. There are two each of six colors. They are printed on um, cardstock weight. And there are, um, it's a 65 pound cover. So it's like the cover of a book. Uh, it's 176 GSM, if that is something that you track. Um, and it is uh, printed on white cardstock. So the benefit of that is that you will always have white cardstock. So you can see a light lavender, a medium, and even lighter. So I guess it's light, medium, dark. And then there's also, this is kind of an orchid. And then we also have the purples. So the same thing where you've got a light, a medium, and a dark. And you're going to get two of each. These are 12 by 12, as you can, can imagine. And you just had some examples of using that on this slimline card. Now, to coordinate with the papers and the um, cardstock, we also have die cuts. And the die cuts are like this. Let me scoot these out of the way. And there are 31 die cuts in the package. Now they come on two sheets. Here are the two sheets. They are um, already die cut for you. Just pop them out of the backing. And again, you've got all of them. Some of them, again, have words on them. Some are left plain, but you've got a wonderful selection. Of course, everything is going to match perfectly. And because this is hot off the press, you get ideas. Well, let me give you a close up with those ideas. Here is one card, and you can see that this is the die cut, or the cutout, excuse me, this is the die cut, this is the die cut, and these are the papers from the collection. Here is another one, and as you can see, just adding some ribbon and some dazzles, it just makes it oh so pretty. This, 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 there are three, four of the die cuts on this particular uh, card. All of these in the lilacs in bloom, but I am not done there is more. The more is chipboard. And on this, there are 18 pieces. And we absolutely love the chipboard. And I'll tell you, at the price, it's just a great deal. And this one has been simply tapped with an ink pad. And doesn't that look just stunning? So the Just For You is right here. There are the lilacs. You can really play with colors of ink. You could use embossing powders. You can use uh, paints, just so many things to finish this off. Absolutely gorgeous. We also have six by six. Let me show you. The six by six is exactly the same, ex ex same artwork, except it's shrunk down. And there are 24 sheets in here and a total of 76 cutouts. So let me just show you the papers. Again, you're gonna get four of each one. So there it is. It's just always fun to see it in a smaller size. And again, this is the same 80 pound paper that we have on the 12 by 12s and all over I, lilacs. 
and there's the cutouts. And if you are curious to see what they would look like, well, there's an idea on the package, but this is the project. And there's one of the cutouts. And I love how the designer did the um, jewel border dazzles and has them kind of coming down, just really lovely. Now, you would think that I'm done, but I'm not. I've got more surprises for you. This time, we have two cutting dies. Here is the cutting edge lilacs, which was the basis of doing all of these. But in addition, there are stems and leaves. Now we separated them because the stems and leaves are gonna be used on other flowers later in the year. And the lilacs, you've got the base and then you've got this in one swoop, you're gonna get 12 flowers. And what would this look like? Well, right here is our very first one. The leaves are embossed, uh, the stems can be straight or curved, the uh, lilac base and then all the flowers were just uh, tapped on. And this is in the lilacs and bloom papers, of course. And this same card is, well, it's on the back of both packages. Now, in addition, a little bit later in the year, we wanted to have some greetings to go with these. So this will be a stamp set and you can see the 11 greetings that will be there all talking about flowers with very uplifting messages. So we have quite a collection in our lilacs in bloom with two cutting dies, six by six chipboard. We have the um, die cuts, we have the cardstock, which is gonna be so nice to have. And then our um, base is always our 12 by 12 papers. So you can see we've been really busy around here. Lilacs in bloom, ready <clears throat> very, very soon.